what Google says on an average we touch our mobile phones like 2600 times a day I mean just imagine in the year 2022 Indians who use Android phones have spent like 4.9 hours daily on their smartphones and in that list you and I are also included with so much content available on social media platforms like Instagram, Facebook and YouTube, it's easy to get lost in a never-ending scroll or a binge watch session. Wait, are you a phone addict? I mean, do you waste most of your time in a day scrolling reels and shots on Instagram and YouTube? Then, this video is for you. platforms like Instagram, YouTube and Facebook continue to gain popularity, it's becoming increasingly important for we users to manage the time spent on these apps. To help users take control on their watch time, both Instagram and YouTube have implemented features that allow users to monitor and to control their usage. On Instagram, the feature is called Your Activity. To access it, users need to tap on the three horizontal lines in the top right corner of their profile. From there, they can select your activity and see how much time they have spent on the app each day over the last week. They can also set a reminder to alert them when they have reached a certain amount of time spent on the app. On YouTube, the feature is called Take a Break. To access it, users need to tap on their profile picture in the top right corner of the screen, then tap on Time Watched. From there, you can see how much time you have spent on the app each day over the last week. You can also set a reminder to take a break after a certain amount of time spent watching videos. This feature is useful for those who want to avoid getting sucked into YouTube rabbit hole and want to limit their time spent on the app. Wow, isn't it cool? I mean, to come out of phone addiction, you don't really have to kick yourself out of social media platforms or to delete your social media account or to uninstall these apps from your phone. It's really important to remember that social media should enhance our lives, not control them. So the features that I've mentioned are just one way to help yourself strike a balance between staying connected and unplugging.